watching, this is Writing Over Productions, and welcome back to Nerd Adventures, episode 40, I believe. We have made it through 10 episodes four times. I don't know, 40 is a number, it's divisible by 10. Very cool. Um, I'm currently recording this on January 1st, 2022. Uh, Happy New Year, or rather, I don't know, it's, it's 2002. Yeah. Well, welcome back to her adventures. So I've finally gotten to publishing some of the Nerd Adventures videos that have yet to be published. As of today, that was Nerd Adventures episode 37, parts one and two. And the one I'm playing on is tomorrow. We'll all publish episode 38 and the third, which I think that's the seventh anniversary of my first video. That is strange. Okay. Well, on the third, um, I am going to publish episode 39, and then whenever this episode number 40 is done, it'll be published. That could be next week, that could be next month, that could be next year, I don't know. But whatever the case, welcome back to your adventures. As usual, I do not have a plan. However, I will show you some things that I have done off camera before the episode because I do a lot of things off camera for some reason. If we take the ladder up here to the roof of the new area, uh, then over here you can see I have added some roofing above the crafting and storage room. I just, for some reason, I was just one like running around up here and I noticed that, hey, I hadn't put slabs or any like roofing here. So I did and I thought cobblestone would be nice. So I put cobblestone. That, that's all I really have to say. Then if we jump into the lake, I'm pretty certain this is the lake. I don't, I mean, I refer to it as lake. I don't, I don't know what goes on over there. You know what? Before I go to my next thingy, we're going to do some adventuring. And eat some fish. We're going to go see how far the lake goes. Okay, it goes over there, and there's lava fall. I feel like I've noticed that before. Neat. Just keep going. Sugar cane. Sheep. More sheep. Very cool. And the blighty glitch. That's a really cool cliff, though. Nice. I can build something up there one day, because, you know, we're in the main area. Yeah. Uh, lava. And then, got more lake. Okay, this is a pretty big lake. So... I think that little bit right there is an island, kind of like the dark oak tree, which I think is pretty cool. Uh, hang on, I see coal up there. I don't really know why I'm mentioning that. There's just coal. Um, yeah, like, does, does it continue back over there, too? Uh, I don't want to have to swim in the water. I'm just going to jump over. And yes, we have this not nice long strand that goes to the tree. Very cool. And one of... Well, okay, so, like, just... This is the... Look at this little pond thing, and it goes straight through the... Like an arch that's kind of blocked, but you, you see over there? That's crazy. Nice. Uh, yeah, it looks to be an island. Okay, does it continue over there? I can't tell. Okay, the lake does end for this portion here. For a kid, I guess we will swim. And. Okay, is that it? That's it for that. And I think that is just a pond. Or wait, does it connect to that other lake? Is that a lake? Yeah, I think that's a lake. Okay, that's kind of like a pond that kind of connects up. And there's floating tree. Very cool. Uh, yeah, there's another lake. Nice. Lots of water around here. Very cool. Uh, so this very large lake. That's like, I don't know. This, there's big areas that are connected by small areas. Like, here's a big area, and then I think there's a small bit over here to another big bit. Okay. Yeah, kind of small bit. Or, you know, I'm going to consider this kind of a small bit. This is another big bit-ish. Then there's a small bit. Then there's another big bit to my house. That, then the main area. Well, I mean, as far as I'm concerned, this entire lake might as well be part of the main area. I don't know. It depends on where I expand and why I do things. Uh, but yeah, small area. Lava. Let's not get burnt. You know what, Frigate? I'm, I feel like spiting the world. Boom. Do we jumped into the lava. Okay. Jokes to people online who I have seen use jump into lava as an insult slash threat. I just did, and I'm still here, and I fell into a cave. Oh, cool, okay, okay, might, might as well take note of this too for, like, mining purposes or just exploration, I don't know. Yeah, uh, oh yeah, okay, over, over here is, there you go, and there's our lake again, 
are, are part of the lake again. Well, no, this it, it, I I own this entire world. The entire lake is mine, as far as I'm concerned. Unless like I invite a friend on, they do something with another part of it. I don't know. But lake house, my house. Yes. Okay. Now over here, where I showed you the pig pen, and oh yeah, I also got some dirt and patch up some creeper holes. Oh, I think it was only really one that was here, so that's why this isn't only really on a ledge. But there's that same bit of path we made. It, boom, more path. Uh, over here, I have cut a little bit more trees by the pig pen, and I have made this thing. I made another pen, or pen, I don't know. Point is, for sheeps, I have been wanting to collect sheeps, and the sun is setting. I have been wanting to collect sheeps for a good while, you know, have wool. Yeah, and let's see, I believe there, I remember seeing some wandering around up here. There's another pig. There we go, sheep. Do I have, I don't have wheat on me. So the thing is, I'm going to need, we oh, there's more lava. Another cave. Okay, that's cool. Other reminds me, I'll show you in a second. So you see we have sheep, and we also saw those sheep like at, over there by the lake uh, a moment ago. And so I'm going to have to get wheat so we can collect the sheep and then put them in the pen and stuff. Yeah. And then right over here is a no, it's over here. I also noticed this earlier off camera. Another, look at this, big cave right here. Possible mining and adventuring opportunities. Yeah. But, um, I'm going to go and sleep and also get wheat. Hello, welcome back. It is day, the sun is rising, I have wheat. However, I don't have any dirt, I only have five cobblestone. And I already have a lot of pigs, as you can tell. Whenever I have, like, spare carrots and there's just all adults, which all of them are adults at this point, but I don't have carrots on me, I could go get some. Uh, uh, I no longer have to have this little, like, staircase thingy I made, so I could, like, if I found some she um, pigs around, I could, like, just sort of reel them in with this instead of having to worry about the atrocity of opening that for a moment while having to worry about everyone getting out. I should get carpets at some point. There's creepers! Fun! The point is, um, I don't have to draw my inventory in my inventory, but I can um, do this for to, to get sheep's in. Because as you can see, we have zero sheep's and um, can't really breed nothing. I mean, maybe I can. I haven't tried, but um, for the moment being, I am not interested in trying. I'm going to go find some sheep. Hola, cómo estás? Is there he's the only one? Okay. Well, at the very least, come forth, my good friend. I'm going to bring you to right over here. It's not even a very far travel, just right over here. Come on, bud. You got it. Uh, let's go over here. Having to destroy the environment. Uh, you know, that's just kind of how it is sometimes. Boom, sheep. Thank you for joining me. I'm gonna like swoop in here. Uh, now we need to let's go find some more sheep. I don't know where else to find besides in that area. That might have just been the only one. Uh, is that no? That's the mushroom stem. I saw something white, and I was like, "Oh, a sheep!" No. If we see something pink, though, that oh no, that probably that might be a pig. Oh, I see sheep over there. Nice. Um, I was probably like, I mean, if we see something pink, that's very rare. That's the um, rarest naturally spawning sheep color. However. That would nevertheless still be a sheep, but then I realize if I see something, uh, if I just see something p pink out of nowhere, it could be, um, you know, a pig. Yeah, uh, I don't know if it's like brown or black, or no, if it's brown, it might be cow. If it's black, probably sheep. If it's gray, either light or dark, it could be a sheep. Um, are you the only one, my friend? So we can wander around a little. I know there's sheep, so like over there. We went in veteran like a year ago. Gosh, like it's 2022 now, meaning um, when I started, like, what? Let's see, I canceled Nerd Ventures Season 3, then I uncanceled, and I made a good few videos of it back in, like, what, late 2020. That stuff was over a year ago now. And give another year, it's going to be two years. I mean, yeah, as last, last I checked, 1 plus 1 equals 2. So, that's good to know. Whatever the case, we have sheep. Come on, buddy, and up over here. And now, you guys can be friends and make children. Bam, look at that. We made a child. We have sheep. Very cool. Uh, yeah, we are actually doing like productive in an episode. Crazy. I have sheep, finally. Okay. Uh, now, let's just go wandering around back over, like, 
there and see if we can find any sheeps. Uh, is that, no, that's yet another mushroom stalk. Okay, that is not a sheep, that is a chicken. Which I guess we can also get, but I don't have seeds. I mean, okay, I was about to destroy and be like, you know, free, let's get some seeds, but then I realized I don't have a pen for chickens either. That can be our next project. We're just gonna have a, we're just gonna be starting an animal farm over there. Or communism. That was a horrible joke. I don't know. Maybe we will start communism. I wouldn't know. But in the meantime, we need to go find sheep. And stay away from that skeleton. Oh, so we're going to horses. No. Boom. Sheep. Two. I think. Four. No. Yeah, four. Okay, thought that one might have been a skeleton. I thought that one might have been a skeleton, which would be a bit of an issue, but, um... Good news is it is that Good news is it is not a skeleton, it is a sheep. Come forth, friends. We're going to go on a journey of over there to the pens. Oh, look, it, there's a sheep over there. Crazy. Okay, I'm gonna let's try and get it as well. How close do I have to be to attract it? Oh, this is this is cool. Whenever sometimes it's cool to see like random like bits of stone just sort of there and you hear lava sounds because that means directly under here is a lava pond that's just not completely surfaced. That's cool. I'm not gonna take it out because I don't if I wanna jump in lava, yeah I can. But not right now. I am attempting to sheep source and there's also no it got lost. Sorry buddy, hopefully I can come back for you later. It is it is a tricky tricky and treacherous adventure to get sheep. And more lava. Oh blah, blah, another sheep. Hello? Nice. Just we're getting close. And also it's getting dark. And see this skeleton? Uh, okay. Come on, we're almost here. We'll all be good. Come on, bud. You know how to jump, I hope. Good job! Okay. Eat the wheat. And make more children. Good job! There we go. So we have... Yet again, more sheep. And... How's about no? Oh, come on. Alright, come over here, into the corner where we don't have to accidentally hit any sheep. Please, not the children! No, not the children! Oh, you frick. No, no, no. See, these zombies are bonkers. Here, have a, have a something to heal you. I don't know if I can heal sheep like this. Okay, well, whatever the case, we're gonna go home. Okay, so that is it for this episode. Thank you for watching Right Angle Productions. Bye.